Hi everyone, this is Ashwa Hai Pink Black VV. Welcome back to my channel. And um, today I will be talking about one interesting subject that everybody concerned um, is um, how to spark your creativity when you lack of it. Now let's jump right into the, the video. The question I come across a lot um, on my consultation with my client is usually they ask about how to spark their creativity in life or when you lack of energy, how can you bring it back into your life? Um, so for me, in certain time in my life, I still have the moment that I still feel lack of all the energy and I don't want to do nothing um, or I just lack of all the my creativity um, I don't know what to do with all the creative projects that I'm running in um, so within that period of time I think first and foremost um, we should take time for ourselves because that our body our mind and our heart um, remind us for to take a rest so we should get our mind completely out of the question how to why and how can we because those questions surrounded in our mind that make our mind dropped more in this issue so i think um take a lot of time be with ourselves is the most uh, important thing to do in those period of time and then um, when taking more time with ourselves, be alone with ourselves, um, we should get out to the nature. That is the second step because the nature usually recharge our energy. So when we take time to be alone, we should go to the park and walk um, in the grass barefoot. Because why we have to walk barefoot? Because it's the energy from the earth will transcend to our body transcend the energy uh, to us make us feel more motivation and when we walk barefoot on the grass and be with nature um, that will make us um, feel more alive because the earth we living right now is have a lot of energy to put the positivity inside ourselves and rejuvenate ourselves. Um, that is the second step. The third step is um, listen to music that positively affect us. Um, the music that soothing our mind and within the period that um, we listening to those music the question how to why and when the creativity will come back to us um, stop and try to pause all those questions and try to um, ignore all the questions that are still wandering inside our mind because we are taking the time to be with ourselves and be with nature so the music will help us um, more in enhancement the transcend from the earth plants and the energy from the earth plants to earth and make us rejuvenate and come out fresher also um, try to read uh, three to five pages a day or at, at least you read five minutes a day from the book that you love whatever book you like as long as it's positively um, affects your body your health and your mind because reading books is kind of um, triggering or sparkling the idea of um, the subconscious mind makes you guys more creative in the future for the long term but not just right now because right now we try to get over the entrapment of the mice asking the question of how when and why the creativity is not come to us so we need some time our body and our mind need some time for all of that energy all of that techniques observe into us so for a certain time um, you take time for yourself you are being with nature and you also read books and listening to music um, your mind and body kind of very relaxing um that is bring us to the last step of the process 
and the last step is a little bit different idea uh, from my own experience um, when I lack of motivation, lack of energy and creativity in my life. Um, I think we should do something different, something that we scare the most in our life because everybody have certain fear in our life that we cannot move forward with some certain plan, certain ideas. So try to do that idea, go different ways. Um, so for example, in my own experience, when I was in the second year of college and when I was in the uh, major of human services, um, I figured out that I don't like the major as I used to like before. So I was in the middle of um, looking for the major that matched with myself and um, I was kind of lacking a lot of motivation and I don't know where to go. I was drowning in a lot of majors that I don't like. Um, and then I just thinking to myself, I don't really, I don't really a good person uh, with mathematics and uh, I'm not bad at it, but I don't good, I don't, I do not good at it. So um, I think to myself, um, should I try to concur mathematics? and um, just do something different to spark my energy and spark my creativity and concur my fear so I can feel a little bit different. I can test it for certain um, semester. So I chose accounting and um, at first it's really challenging. It's really struggling for me to get over from courses to courses, from classes to classes. But then uh, the more I get deeper and deeper to accounting, the more I find it more interesting to me because when I pass through certain classes, when I pass through certain exams and try to concur it, I actually figured out that I'm not really bad at math like I used to think before. So um, I think when you want to spark the energy and spark the creativity, you should try something completely different from what you used to do before. For example, you used to be a painter, but now you just try to do something in art, but a uh, completely different different thing. For example, you used to draw animals, but now you change completely to something that um, uh, you don't like or you avoid to do when you be a painter. Um, you try to draw human, for example, that's the thing that you avoid when you was a painter. So I think it's really help the more you concur it, um, the more you figure out um, the new thing and th that new thing, that new path, that new directions will give you more motivation day by day. Um, so this is the end of the video. I hope um, this is a short video, but I hope th those techniques will help you guys was um, sparking your creativity again when you lose it or when you lack of it. And um, this is will affect for all of the genders, all of the um, ages in life and all of the path that we chosen, not just only art. Um, and uh, thank you for you guys watching. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please like, share and subscribe the video. Bye.